Hello, everybody. This is Pastor Phil with Full of Life Ministries. Today's message is entitled, Don't Let Life Slip Away. In the book of James, chapter 4, verse 14, it tells us, it says, you don't really know about tomorrow. What is your life? You are a mist that appears for only a short while before it vanishes. This is the $64,000 question. What is your life? It's always a good thing to look back in retrospect, to analyze and pose this question to yourself. Has your life lined up with the basic principles that the Lord intended for you to live. You see, there are so many temptations that try to distract you from fulfilling your God-given purpose. And if you're not careful, you can lose precious time and opportunities to experience life in its fullness. And in Ephesians chapter 5, verses uh, 16 and 17, I believe, it says, So be careful to live your life wisely, not foolishly. Take advantage of every opportunity because these are evil times. Because of this, don't be ignorant, but understand the Lord's will. Yes, we are living in evil times, but ignorance is no excuse for missing opportunities for you to excel. Because this passage of scripture suggests taking an aggressive approach in living skillfully through life's experiences. All the time, whether we see it on Instagram or Facebook, whether we see it on our television screens, successful people don't allow doubt or the possibility of coming up short. And the reason why is because they always consider the alternative, missing out when the moment of truth has arrived at your doorstep. Wise people don't live life foolishly. Wise individuals use godly principles because they have grabbed hold of God's will and purpose for their life. St. Luke 22 and 42 shows us that Jesus prayed to the Father and he prays this prayer by saying, Father, nevertheless, not my will, but let your will be done. When he echoed these words through prayer, this changed the course of history forever. How about you? What have you done to change the course of your history? Are you willing to make the ultimate sacrifice for change to take place? Or will you let this precious moment pass you by? People of God, life is like a vapor. We are here on this earth, but for a short time. So don't allow temptation or fear or anything that may cause you to slip. His will is for you be successful. His will for you to experience the power of God like never before. Today I want you to be encouraged and I want you to continue to keep shining. And thanks again for tuning in to Full of Life Ministries. God bless you.